This video is about word problems uh, about uh, quadratic functions. For 1a, Bella throws a ball from the top of a wall onto flat horizontal ground. The path of ball is uh, modeled by the quadratic function y equals 3 plus 4x minus x squared, where x represents the horizontal distance. The ball is uh, thrown and uh, y represent the height of the ball above the ground. All distance are measured in meters. The wall lies along the y-axis, and the curve intersects the y-axis at point A and has its vertex at point B. Write down the height in meters from which the ball was uh, thrown. We know this is a y-intercept. So we write down y equals uh, standard for negative x squared plus 4x plus 3. As we know, c is a y-intercept, so this is a 0, 3. For 1b, calculate the maximum height above the ground reached by the ball. You can work this out by graphing calculator, or you can do h equals negative b over 2a. So you have a negative b is opposite of b, that's negative 4. 2 times negative 1, you will get 2. The k equals f of 2, which means negative 2 squared plus 4 times 2 plus 3. Then you will get uh, 7. So for this, uh, maximum will be 2, 7. In other words, the maximum height uh, equals uh, 7 meters. For 1c, Find the horizontal distance from the base of wall to the point at which the ball hits the ground. Which means we are looking for this uh, x-intercept. So we put y equals negative x squared plus 4x plus uh, 3 into graphing calculator. Get the x-intercept. equals 4.65 meters. Let's go to 12a. The length of one side of a rectangle is 2 cm longer than its width. If the smaller side is x cm, find the perimeter of the rectangle in terms of x. You will draw this uh, rectangle. Smaller size, that's x. Then the longer side is uh, 2 centimeters longer than its uh, width. Therefore, you have x plus 2. The perimeter, here's x plus 2, here's x. So you add Together, you will get this uh, perimeter equals 4x plus 4. Let's go to 12b. The length of one side of a rectangle is uh, 2 cm longer than its width. The perimeter of a square is a uh, equals to the perimeter of the rectangle in part A. Determine the length of each side of uh, the square in terms of uh, x. Think about the square. Suppose this is all y. Perimeter will be 4y equals 4x plus 4. 
then the length of each side of this square means y. We need to figure this y out. So we divide it by 4 for every term in this equation. You will get the y equals x plus 1. So we have y equals x plus 1. Let's go to 12 C. The sum of uh, the area of a rectangle and the square is uh, this. Given that this sum is uh, 49, find x. So we have 2x squared plus 4x plus 1 equals uh, 49. You can go to equation solver. All by graph uh, to figure out. Before you go to equation solver or by graph, move everything to the left side, get the equal zero. So you have 2x squared plus 4x. 1 minus 49 will be negative 48 equals to zero. If you put it into Equation solver, you will get the x equals to 4. Or you can solve this uh, by factoring. So we divide it by 2 both sides. You will get the x squared plus 2x minus 24 equals to 0. We're doing this by linear x, 24 over 1 over 1. So you get positive 6, negative 4 x plus 6 times x minus 4. Therefore, your x1 equal negative 6, x2 equals to 4. This one we cross out. x equals 4 will be the solution. Then find the area of a square. We know for each side of the square, that is uh, x plus 1. So x plus 1. That equals uh, 5. Therefore, the area of square will be a 5 squared. That equals 25.